that all right quick update sorry I couldn't take it long for the rest of the video but here's where we're at um, I decided to go ahead and make a four leaf clover I guess that's kind of the design that you'd call it and what I believe I'm going to do on the bottom is do kind of like a stem like you normally see decals have I don't know it kind of makes it look like a flower I don't want it to look too girly anyway uh, the ends are complete the center is complete it's just tacked on there it's, it's not really welded seriously makes a big difference though when uh, when you have clean metal versus dirty metal this is dirty metal welds came out really shitty and then after I learned my lesson over there everything's been going a lot smoother uh, so yeah how I managed to do these tow hooks is I took a straight edge and I marked it out on the bottom and I clamped them together and I cut the bottoms off with an angle grinder so they're going to sit flat against the plate. Um, I measured the distance between the two tips. Um, I did one tack on the top here uh, just to hold it in place and that's a little hot. And I'll see. And I did a nice, uh, nice row of dimes on the bottom there, and that'll give it a lot of strength. And additionally, once I weld down the four corners, um, I don't think I'm going to do the inside, but that that should give me plenty of strength for any kind of light duty towing or tow hooks or utility hooks, whatever you want to call it. So yeah, here are the finished welds for the tow hooks. I mean, they're not picture perfect, but they are very clean and strong welds, and they are not going anywhere. Uh, next step I need to do is take some of this. It's pretty heavy duty. It's got to be, I don't know, it's pretty thick stuff. It's heavy duty 2x2, uh, two two, and I'm going to use this. It's going to get welded on the other side. This thing's pretty heavy. You may have to add a gusset this just to be safe but yeah that's gonna be the next step too here's what the gusset welds turned out like they're actually very clean it's just a little splatter the thing is red hot right now I tell you what though that oxyacetyl that oxyacetylene torch is an absolute lifesaver I made a rookie mistake and I ended up welding uh, the right side before I put any of the gusset plates on I welded the the right side there then the bottom side and as all you expert welders out there know that it will if you don't tack it on there properly um, the metal will expand and contract and what ended up happening I had it fall to the right so what I ended up doing I took the oxyacetylene and I heated up one two three sides of this tubing here and then you can see my hammer marks and I wailed it with a mallet and it ended up moving it, moving it back thankfully it, it was off like a quarter inch and you know I put it in the receiver over there and oh, just got me so nervous but everything turned out wonderful